99 milligrams. Um, for this one, uh, this is going to be involve unit conversions. And the way that I do it, this involves at least two unit conversions. I'm going to start with the number in my problem, 199 milligrams. And I'm going to convert milligrams into grams first. So I know that one milligram equals one times 10 to the minus three grams. Any two things that are equal to each other, you can put above and below each other. I know that I want my milligrams on the bottom because my milligrams will then cancel. And this is a version use of solving this using what I usually do, which is the picket fence. And then my next one, my units over here are going to be kilograms. So I'm going to turn grams into kilograms. And you can do this in one step. I always like to go back to grams because I can remember this conversion, grams to milligrams. And I can remember that one thousand grams equals one kilogram and grams go on the bottom to cancel and here is what I'm left with for my calculation I'm now going to multiply 199 times 1 times 10 to the minus third so times 1 exponent 3 minus divided by 1,000 and I get this number here which is 0 0.000199 which is a fine answer. If you would rather put in scientific notation you get 1.99 times 10 to the minus 4 and I just like to have my units next to them those are both equivalent ways of saying the same number in kilograms.